Hello everybody, it is me Alice and today I'm going to film a makeup collection because I've not filmed one in a while and I've got a lot of new makeup so without further ado, let's go on the video. I store my makeup in the Alex 5 drawers because they have lots of space to store your makeup in and I love them. All of my makeup brushes, sculpting brush, foundation brush, um, uh, setting brush, blush brush which is so pretty and I love this so much. You also have a powder brush, a primer brush which is really good and I love this so much. Multitask brush, blending bronzer and everything so I recommend that. You could contour brush which is so good and then another powder brush as well. I know I have loads of powder brushes somehow. Yeah. In my um, Zoella pot I have my um, pink sponge and it's really pretty and it's like like it's just really nice. Then I also have these small ones which is really cute for concealer and I also have this one and it's also so cute and yeah I love that. Over here in my pot I have a range of like eyeshadow brushes so I've got some from Amazon I've got like 12 for three pounds and I also have some other branded ones and I also like have some ones from Primark and everything like that and honestly they are amazing and so soft to blend with as well so I do love these brushes. Well a double cream which smells incredible literally it's so nice and it's really good and I love this so much so yeah. Over here I have my acrylic drawers from eBay which I use to store lots of my lipsticks and lots of my hand sanitizers and like eye glitters and everything like that. And on here I, I, I have, have my Mario spray which is amazing as I love like to use it like for my makeup sponges and honestly it's just so good so I love that. So on my drawers I have my soap and Gloria handmade which is amazing literally it <laughs> smells of, like the clean on me that's really good and then also over here I have some of my other hand sanitizers like the pocket back ones like the pretty as a peach, sweet pea and champagne sparkle as well and they are incredible. And if you move over here, I have some of my Too Faced melted lipsticks, which are in a range of shades like pinks and purples and reds. Then over here, I have two of my Soap and Glory Mother Pucker lipsticks, which make your lips really plumped. And honestly, the colour of them are really pretty on your lips as well. And literally, I love them. Then here, I have my MAC lipstick in Men Love Mystery, which is like a lovely purple shade. And it's really pretty, so yeah. Then if we move over here, I have my NYX eye glitter in the shade Copper and it is so pretty for any glam makeup look. Then over here, I have my Ben Tint and Posy Tint and these are so pretty to use as like lipsticks or lip glosses and yeah, I love them. In the first drawer of, of my acrylic drawers, I have all of my, my NYX lipsticks. I have the butter glosses in the nude and purple shade and then I also have some of the soft matte lip creams which are so soft and creamy on your lips. And then underneath there, I just have some of the NYX lingerie <laughs> lipsticks, which are my favourite. And then I also have like some of like the other ones, which came in like a few sets and everything. And they are so pretty, and I love these lipsticks. In the next drawer, I have some of the Revolution liquid lip kits, which come with like the liquid lipstick and the lip liner. And I also have a Revlon lipstick, which is really pretty, and I'm sure it's in the shade Sweet Tart. Then if we move over here, I've got lots of perfumes, so I've got my Lipsy perfume, which is really handy to take in your handbag, and it smells incredible. And then I also have my Lancome perfume, which is basically a cream formula, and it lasts so long, and it smells really nice as well. Then here I have the Snowella lotion and perfume and they are really nice and then I also have the Ted Baker mists which are in pink and white and they are really nice and smell really nice as well. Then over here I have my Tommy Hilfiger perfume which smells incredible but we don't have anything left in it. And then I also have my spray which smells of candy floss and this is from Superdrug for £3 and it's really nice and I love that. And then be and then in front of that I also have the Floral Rush, the Vera Wang perfume and it smells really nice and I love it. So here in the first drawer of my Alex drawers I just got like all my face makeup so here I have my Kat Von D foundation which is amazing and so high coverage. Over here I have my LA Girl foundation in the shade Fair and I love this so much. I then have my L'Oreal True Match foundation which is incredible and is a perfect shade for me because you know I'm really pale. And then I also have my NYX Stay Matte 
Hood Not Flat foundation which is amazing however it's a little bit too like light coverage but I still love it and then I also have my Revolution Stick foundation which as it, like if you may have seen the video I love it so much. For my primer I have the L'Oreal Infallible Primer and this is my favourite primer ever just because it acts like a glue for your foundation and it's so good. I also have the matte professional primer which is really good and I love this because it makes your face really matte so if you are quite oily then this will be perfect. I also have the original professional which is amazing. I also have the NYX pore filler which is a dupe for the professional and I love it so much. And I also have the collection primed and ready primer. And finally I have the revolution ultra face base primer as well. If we move on to concealers I have the Rimmel match perfection concealer which is amazing. I then have the Revolution concealer which is my new favourite and works perfectly with the new foundation stick. I also have the NYX concealer and the LA Girl as well which are amazing. Moving on to bronzers and blushes I've got the Master Sculpt bronzer which is lovely for pale skin because the bronzer is a lovely light colour and is super blendable and then over here I have the Honeycomb blusher which is so pretty and gives off a lovely highlight. Next I have the Dandelion Blush and this is beautiful for pale skin because the colour is so pretty and pink and it smells really nice as well so yeah I love that blusher. I also have the NYX Away We Glow Square and this is lovely and it's really illuminating. Next I have the Too Faced No Filter Selfie Powders. These are really pretty and can make like your selfies look really different so the yellow one can make it look more yellow and like obviously the other ones make it look more like their colours so yeah I love that. I then have the Revolution Bronzer Highlight and Blush Palette and as you can tell I've used the highlight a lot and this is really good for £2.50. I also have the Cream Formula which is good for contouring your face. I also have a Ted Baker Bronzer and Blusher and this is really pretty and the packaging is so gorgeous and I love it. At the back of my drawers I have my Anastasia Moonchild Palette which is so pretty and it's so pigmented as well and I love it. I also have the Kat Von D Shade and Light Palette and this is really nice and I use it almost every day. At the back of my drawers I have my Revolution Pro Amplified Palette because it is absolutely massive so I've got to keep it at the back but yeah it's so good. Over here I have my Nivea Men Pro Shave Balm which I use as a primer but it's really good. I also have my MUA highlighter and I also have my Revolution highlighter as well. And then over here I have my NYX powder which is really good. And then over here I have my collection powder which I smashed to make a loose powder because it is so good. Then over there I have my Ted Baker cream blusher which is really pretty. I then have my Unicorn Hearts highlighter which is lovely. And then here I have two of my Blush and Hearts blushes. Here I have four of my setting sprays so I've got a mini NYX one and I've got four of the Revolution ones which are so good. So moving on to my eye draw, firstly I have the L'Oreal Miss Manga Mascara which is amazing. Next I have the minis of the Roller Lash and the Zare Real and then I also have the Max Factor Masterpiece Mascara which is my fave. And then I have the NYX Duo Mascaras as well and I also have the NYX Tame and Firm Eyebrow Pomade. For eyeshadows I have the Balm Nutude eyeshadow palette which is so beautiful and then I also have the Modern Renaissance eyeshadow palette and I also have the Lightly Toasted as well which are so pretty. I then have the Tarte's eyeshadow palette and the Eye Glitter and then this gold eyeshadow as well. Then moving on to eyeliners I've got the Tanya Burr Glitter eyeliner in silver which is really pretty and then I also have a NYX matte eyeliner which is amazing for doing winged eyeliner. And then I also have the NYX Vivid Brights eyeliner in pink and this is a beautiful colour and it's so gorgeous. And then I have a white eyeliner and then I also have an eyelid primer as well and also I have another eyelid primer. At the back of my drawers I have my Morphe 35O palette which is beautiful and it's got lots of red and shimmery shades in it. I then have my eyebrow kit from Revolution and then I also have my Iconic 3 palette and another palette and I also have my NYX one as well. Moving on to the third draw I have all of my baby lips and lip balms so here I have my baby lips in crystal, the pop art, the Christmas ones and the originals as well. I then have a NYX lip balm and I also have some of the jewels ones as well. I also have some of the pinky goat eyelashes in, in the style Maram. I also have some duo lash glue and some Primark nails.
So I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to leave a thumbs up and a comment down below. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye!